Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Lunchtime Lottery, the most delicious show in the world. We got a very special guest. We got Mel Mitchell in the house, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, We're guys. on tour right now. Yes. It's very loud in the lobby. And so there's yeah. no way I could do this downstairs, so I had to turn the air off and do it. And now it's starting to warm up a little bit. So we're gonna, we're gonna we're gonna get through this as quick I as possible. I, I, it's warm, it's warm, I feel it. But the air, the AC unit that we're sitting the food on <laughs> will cool the food too fast. So uh, first off, Sacramento, I love Sacramento. It's one of those cities where you really just gotta be immersed in it and you really like, you, I don't know, you find your thing. For me, I, I just really like the people and I love the food. Sacramento has some of the best Mexican food in California, in my opinion. I've had a lot of a lot of amazing food. So today I was like, well, I gotta gotta do Mexican food. We'll just, just keep it going. So I found this place on Postmates. Um, this place is called, wait a second, Taqueria A Jalisco. I'm sure I butchered that. I apologize, but listen, this is it. So I ordered a whole lot of stuff, okay? Because they had a whole lot on the menu and I was like, I want to try everything. One of the things they had on the menu was this churro. So before we even get into the, the, the whatchamacallit, the review, I'm going to start eating this because churros are only good when they're hot. Now, you already yeah. had to travel here. We and, air fryer. Yeah, we got no air fryer. We got no microwaves in here. I don't even have a refrigerator. They gave Mel a refrigerator in her room. Only the rooms on five and six. Yeah, I didn't ask for it. Just, I just, I just got what y'all gave. She be a demon on tour, y'all. Oh, I have been acting so much better. <laughs> it's, it's, it's all. Tell me, people, how you made the girl walk for your ice cream, Mel? No, see what had happened. She offered, and I was like, sure, my girl. You know, sis. Listen. Do what you gotta do. They had brownie it situation. Was, it was so good on the menu. It was so good. She went to get the brownie. She told Mel, I was like, hey, we don't have any ice cream. Would you like me to go get you some? Thinking that no way this young lady is gonna tell her, absolutely, go find, get out there and hit the road, See, Jack, and find me some ice cream, and that's exactly what she did. First of all, we were in a very busy area, so it was ice cream in the radius where we were. But we had already had a conversation. She was like, "I'm because the day before they had messed up with our mm. order, and she was like, girl, whatever you need, I got you. Mm. And I'm like, this, like, all right, now, you said you're gonna give me some ice cream. And she was like, what, do you want me to go grab you some? I was like, sure, bitch, like, go ahead. <sighs> You know what? <laughs> there are certain questions that are completely uh, rhetorical. Because there's no way. There's no way this person is going to actually want you to do that. She did. But I, I, in my mind, I'm like, oh, it's probably an ice cream place over here. Because it was like in the town square. That lady brought the ice cream back. She had been shot twice. <laughs> she, and uh, she, she, it but she brought really it back. She brought it back. She was fine. Mm. She was great. I mm -hmm. talked to her. I thanked her personally. I right. tipped her. It was great. Okay. It was like, it was it was really good ice cream and brownie dough. It was. It was like Nutella on it. Oh, so good. But yeah, tacos. So today I ordered. Can I try to uh, Yeah, yo, get your piece. I wanted you to grab your piece too. Today I ordered uh, a humongous wet burrito. We got some shrimp tacos. We got a, I think I got the asada torta. Um, we got a Bria burrito and two orders of Bria tacos. Uh, mm -hmm. They got cheese on them. Of course, it came with the sauce. Mm -hmm. We just going to dive right in. We just had the churro. Uh, oh, we'll rate the churro in a little bit when we rate everything else. But I just wanted to see if I could get a little bit of that essence of it still hot. It's still still warm. Mm -hmm. Let me get you slide over just a little bit, man. I'm just, all right, there you go. Now we get you in frame. All right. But let's jump right into this. But before we do... We gotta thank the good people over at Express v VPN because they they so graciously donated to this episode of Lunchtime Lottery. Listen, for those that don't know, let me tell you, I know none of you outstanding citizens watch porn, okay? But you might have some friends that do, okay? Now that's their business. That's their business. Whatever they do in their free time is their business. But the thing is, their business might be getting out. You see, anybody that is using just regular internet without a VPN, can be, you can be intercepted. Let's just put it that way. They can know exactly what's going on from your ISP. Your internet service provider can get all that information. They can sell it to all of these people. I've been getting texts for the last couple of days about elections and all this type of stuff. I'm like, how y'all getting my number? 
How am I getting these emails? I got, I got five emails. How am I getting stuff to each and every email? It's because I had my ExpressVPN turned off for a month. And now I got to turn it back on because now y'all are wilding out here. When you use ExpressVPN, your internet connection is rerouted through a secure encrypted server so you can surf the web anonymously without anyone looking over your shoulder. And that's what I like, okay? Give me my personal space. I need six feet. I don't want you looking over my shoulder, seeing what I'm buying, seeing what's on my Amazon wish list, see what I'm streaming. Get out of my business, okay? Look. I know probably, you all probably think that using incognito mode is the trick. It's not, okay? It not, incognito mode does not protect you. Uh, it does not reroute your ISP. It does not reroute your thing. They still can see what you're looking at, what you're shopping. They know all that info information. Even when you use incognito mode, your internet provider like Verizon or ATT can see every single website you visit. And if you live on campus and use a shared Wi-Fi, your network admin can too. So all you college students, mm. all right? Just, just throwing that out there. Without ExpressVPN, you're giving people a free license to peek over your shoulder and see all the freaky shit that you're looking at, okay? Jeez. Now, I know they meant that because they actually put that in the copy. It, it actually says freaky shit. I don't know if you can see it right there, but it says freaky shit, so they meant that. So to protect your privacy today, get three months of ExpressVPN for free. Visit expressvpn.com slash scary lunch. That's express, E X P R E S S, VPN.com slash scary lunch for three months free with a one year package. Okay, you gotta get that one year package. You're gonna get that after three. You're gonna get 15 months in total. You understand me? Visit expressvpn.com slash scary lunch to learn more. Got the shrimp tacos, wet burrito, torta. Maria burrito, and then we got two orders of cheese burrito, burrito tacos, and some churros. Let's jump into this food. You know how like them videos where you get the top the fruit snacks and like, okay, you can't eat them, don't eat them till I come back. That's how I've been feeling. <laughs> You've been wanting to go so oh, bad. God, it looks so good. Like the top. All right, well, listen. Let me let me let me grab. We could do these together, then we'll we'll break down everything else one by one. Now I love this sauce. You gotta have the sauce. Have you gotta it. have it when you got the real tacos. It's my first authentic. Thing. Really? It's for real, yeah. Oh man, we about to go crazy. We're about to go crazy. Oh, now these oh, are cheesy. Let me take a picture. Bria tacos. I'm saying it wrong, and I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, yeah. I don't mean no disrespect. Y'all just know I can't talk for real like that. But yeah, this is cheesy. It's not just a just a burrito, but this one they put a little extra something on it right here. All right, so just really take a bit. <laughs> I got to see this is somebody. Okay, okay, here we go. Got to do that little dippage right there. Dip, dip, do that little dippage right there. Uh huh. God Almighty. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, that's good. Mm. That's good. That. Mm. People are like, how do you know that God is real? How I know? Mm. How I know? <laughs> how I know? Now listen, we don't typically eat everything within the first bite because we got a couple things to eat, but this one is getting a second bite. Mm. Oh God. Mm-hmm. Today. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I need to go take my medicine. Mm. Because I'm gonna pay for this. <laughs> All the cheese? Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So I need you to remember what that was like. Mm -hmm. So you can give it a good rating. Now we rate it on bites system like how many bites? One bite, two bite, three bite, five being the highest, one be the lowest, okay? So Mm. Mm. I'm just sneaking one more and then. Well, it's gonna go ahead. You know what I'm saying? Leave your life. Okay, so go ahead and grab this shrimp joint. Okay? Okay. Right and then, uh, you don't do seafood? Oh, okay. I don't know how you're doing this. So oh, I'll like, just, I'll just, I'll just get it. I'm not a seafood person. I don't want to waste it, though. You just take one bite. Okay. That's what I bought it for. Bought it for a real review. Just for a bite, okay. Mm hmm. Mm, mm, mm. I'm looking at the cheese on the aluminum foil. But the tacos came in, and even the cheese is sexy. That'd be the best part. It's reaching out like. Oh, That'd be the best. 
speaking part. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ready? One, two. I'm not mad at it. No, you don't have to do that. I just put a little lime juice on it. That lime would have hit with it, but hot. Take the. Oh, okay. All right. Take mm. it to the hair. Mm hmm. Okay. Be a little lime in right now. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Whoa! With that lime, though? I know the lime took it up. Mmm, it's up. I'm, again, I'm not a seafood girly, but I'm not mad at that. Mmm. You gotta keep coming over. You keep getting yourself cut out of that thing now. No, sorry. Mmm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, they threw it in. They're passing one of them. Mm-hmm. There we go. I was cool with it. I don't think I asked for those nappers. <laughs> I don't know what I mean. You think they did it? Mm, 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 mm. All right. What's next? Okay. Um. Yeah, no utensils or nothing. Man, no utensils or nothing. You know what up? Like that. They, they might have some in the little coffee. I, I know you got the stirs. I'm just, I'm just. <laughs> we gonna have the jailhouse. The jail is. Yeah, just. Phone check, home phone check. Okay. Yeah. We're just gonna do something different. Okay. Man, that was... <laughs> that's... <laughs> that's good, man. <laughs> They're going to have to come clean my room after this because I ain't got no... I ain't got... I, I ripped the bags open trying to get the food out. Mm-hmm. It's showing up there. Mm -hmm. It's the wet. A little wet burrito. Now, you give me that right... <sighs> Actually, look. Let me do this. Let me do this. Let me improvise. Let me okay. Go. All right. Oh, it's, it's a lot going on. I just I grab that. You can grab that one. Or it might no, be take, yeah, take okay, this. Okay, I'll, I'll take this. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it's so big, guys. Yeah. That's what she said. That's what she said. <laughs> Hello. Yum, yum, yum. Hey, oh. All right, I'm going to try to get a little bit. Of, it's got the green sauce on it. Get a little sour cream on it. It is. It's falling all over the place. Yeah, it is. Okay, here we go. Mmm. Mm-hmm. 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 No, Man. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> mm. I know what they're doing, bro. We both went in at the same time. Okay. I know what they're doing, bro. Okay. We still got two things to try. <laughs> Life of a job is never done. <laughs> Always, you know? All right. Mm. I like that. Mm -hmm. God, I wish I had a fork because mm -hmm. that's so messy that you it's can't. It's so messy, yo. Okay. Okay. Let's keep going. Sandwich? No, we'll do mm -hmm. that last. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to do the burrito last. I'm going to try the little sandwich. Right no. That's already kind of cut it, so mm -hmm. bring your little prehistoric tool. That's <laughs> how they was dipping it up. Buffalo. <laughs> Natives. This is dancing. This is this is this is sad. What I'm doing right now, if y'all can see me, I'm uh, cutting this torta okay. with the with the stir, the coffee stir. We, uh, we had improvised one. Mm -hmm. okay. just... I I give you the paper, and I'll do. Oh, she's. Oh, Ooh, that avocado one. Oh, I know okay. this might be good. Oh, I know this good. Here we go. I'll be back on. Okay. You see it? Got the sada, the avocado, the it's pico good. de gallo, toasted bread, the soft bread too. The bread is so soft. The bread tastes like almost like like a sweet bread too. Mm -hmm. That avocado come in strong. I ain't never have avocado be that present. Oh my god. That's first day of school avocado. Mm. 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 
Mm. I have never gone back on a restaurant's Yelp or mm. Uber, I mean Postmates page and left a review. I would do it for this company right here. Mm -hmm. You got a, ooh, and it's like a little fatty piece of that. Mm-hmm. They clowned it. They clowned it, y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Put some lime on it. No, me. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Go. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They clowned it. They went stupid. Mm. Oh, I got mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. Very pleased with that. Okay. Wow. Wow. Yeah, they, they hit me. They, they're knocking they, They're taking a lot of boxes, guys. Taking a lot of boxes. That was the last one. This is uh, a burrito. 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 <laughs> You're trying to set me up with that one. I know I was going to mess that up. Mm -hmm. oh. Right? That rice. You see that rice. Don't tell rice. me to be ready. Listen. Because I'm going to be out asleep. Okay. This is the last one, though. You only got to take one bite. Sauce already over, open over there. Yeah. Just gonna get a little bit. I'm gonna have to juggle this because this is gonna fall apart. Yeah. I'm gonna get all that rice in there too. Okay. Okay, there we go. Mm. 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 That's enough. Mmm. Very rarely. Come across a company mm -hmm. where all the video items are fire. Mm -hmm. This is like one stand out. See, I didn't get enough meat in my bite. Oh, so you gotta go from that the bottom. That's where that meat is right there. Mm -hmm. I got the meat in that I bottom right there. You can keep that rice. Yeah, I just got rice and beans. I need some meat. Mm. I'm not in my hunger. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Mm. Wowzers. Mm. Okay. That was me. That Damn was, it. That was me right there. Wow. Mm. Wow, we. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get this last little bite of this first taco, though. Been staring at me since I sat it down. Like, you don't need, I knew it was just a one night oh, thing. These tacos didn't finish. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's what I need right there. Okay. Okay. Mm hmm. 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 Try to rate this bad boy. All right. Now, as y'all know, we do the rating system on bites. One to five bites, with one being the lowest, five being the highest. Let's start with the churros, because we had that first. Oh, that's a smooth three bites. I'm right there. I'm right there with you. There's nothing spectacular. Churros are great. And I've uh, had that hot. Yeah, fresh out the grease probably would have been a, a good five. Mm -hmm. It was decent in however many minutes it took for it to get to me. Yeah, yeah. But it was, it was good. It was solid. You know what I mean? So I'm going to get that solid three as well. Three bites on the churros. Mm. Moving on. I'm going to jump around a little bit. Mm -hmm. Shrimp tacos. One bite. Come on. One bite for you. Mm -hmm. Come on. I'm going to give them shrimp tacos a good three and a half. Okay. It was getting some fresh shrimp. It was big pieces of shrimp too. It went those little bitty shrimps. I put that little, uh, that lime on it too. The lime? See, I didn't do the lime. Um, hidden, I probably should have locked it. Well, that line was hidden, baby. You know what I mean? So, I'm getting that three and a half. You know what I mean? Honestly, it was really good. I'm not a real big seafood person either, but that was solid. Uh, the torta. Five. 
I'm giving it five. Five is like super surprise? Okay. Exactly. Four and a half then. Okay, I'll take it. If you gave it five, I would have took it. I would give that to the, um, I'd probably give it a four too. I ain't gonna hold you. It might be a four and a half. I, you know, I'm a person that likes mayo, but I understand that like yeah. that might be disrespectful in some cultures. I'm not trying to disrespect nobody. I just, when I got two pieces of bread, I think sandwich, I think sandwich, I think mayo. I need mayo, yeah. So mayo would have set it off. You know, even if it was some Chipotle mayo, Chipotle mayo would set that thing on fire. It would have been mm -hmm. on fire in my mouth, okay? Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna give that a four. She gave it a four and a half. Mm -hmm. um, the wet burrito, I was with the chicken. It was a lot, it was a lot. Um, I, I, I can't get it really more than like two and a half, three. Yeah. Two and a half, three bites on that one. Same. The chicken was good. Everything was, it was just, it was a lot. It's something that you have to eat with a knife and fork. You're not picking that bad boy up. And we didn't have any utensils and no napkins. That's the only, that's going to be my main complaint with this company. That they, mm -hmm. they didn't give me no napkin. That's the one thing I put in there. I put, I typed that in there. Uh, so, um, let's give that two and a half, three bites mm -hmm. on the wet burrito. When it comes to, uh, that was a uh, yeah the burrito burrito that's why I was made it too late the burrito burrito I'm gonna say that all wrong I'm sorry guys the BB, BB. okay I'm getting that bad boy three and a half yeah once mm -hmm. I got to the meat it was good yeah that meat is solid they 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 beef meat is good <laughs> the beef, that beef meat it be it be hitting it, was, it was a lot of rice and beans but it's a burrito that's what it's supposed to be now yeah. I will say. When ordering, they give you an option to remove one of those things or all of those things. You can get it how you want it. I do appreciate that they allow you to customize it, yeah. even on the website, which is a great thing because a lot of places still haven't got hip to that. So, because even you know. in Chipotle, you can't even get no salad dressing on the app. Oh man, they they, they hide that salad dressing like it's made with angel tears. Just make it. Y'all got to get there. Y'all get there an hour early to set up everything. Y'all act like y'all can't make no more of that dressing. Y'all know that dressing good on everything. Right. Why would y'all introduce it to the black community? Y'all don't want us to yeah. order because we gonna order it. And we love a sauce. Oh, we love a sauce. We, we some saucy, sauce. saucy stuff, people, man. And this here? Oh, all right. Moving on to the BTs. All right, the Bria Tacos. Bria Tacos. Bria Tacos. Five. Whole. Five of them things. Big five dog. 5.0 Mustang, 1994. You understand me? Fire, fire, fire. Double tortilla up out here. It's like double cheeked up. Got the cheese on it on the outside. Amazing. You dip that thing on in there. You pull them aluminum foil drawers on down and you go to work. You the hear crisp. me? The crisp. Period. I, I, there's nothing else to say. Listen. It was, uh, that was a good time. This was a good decision to go with Mexican food. I always probably will anytime I'm in Sacramento. Love Sacramento. Have a great so, time here. Um, I am going to overall give the restaurant. Give it 3.8. That's fair. Because, like, have you sat down and got this stuff fresh out? Mm -hmm. It would have been real good. And it would have been a four if I had got my napkins. Because I specifically typed yeah. that in the instructions. Okay? And especially when the food is this messy. Come on, now. You know I need some napkins. You're going to use a hotel rags. Now, what I'm going to wash my face with in the morning. Now, I got to call the people to come in and give me more rags. And they're going to think you dirty because now it's going to have all kinds of... Yeah. Different color stains. Yeah, yeah. They were like, oh, you need to go see Planned Parenthood. That's what they're going to say. It's green sauce on that. It's green sauce on that towel. So uh, I'm going to give it a 3.8. What would you give it? Real whole restaurant? Nah, I'm, I'm with you. The it's a, yeah. Okay. Nah, retweet. All right. Retweet. Retweet on the 3.8. 3.8 on that retweet right there. Um, Listen, man, if you're looking for some good food, make sure you check them out. Um, got everything right here on the screen. You can check them out. Good food. I had a good time eating. Oh, the BTs though. The Bria Tacos. I'm not finished oh. with the BTs. Okay. As you should. As you should. They are amazing. So good. So good. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Special shout out to our special guest, Mel Mitchell, for top, hopping in to this episode. We'll see you next time. Next time. <clears throat> oh, I'm going to do all of that part of shit. <laughs> you know what? Leave it in. Leave it in. Vasectomy style. That's okay, we'll see you next time on another episode of Lunchtime Lottery. Bye, y'all. <laughs>